Hey YouTube, Sergeant Somebody here today, giving you a video. This is the Rat 7 gaming mouse compatible with Mac and PC. It's very nice overall. It costs me about $100 from the Mac store. As you can see, it has three different programmable modes. It comes with software you can use in a computer. Don't know if you can see that, but that's pink, red, and nice blue. I prefer red because it matches with my keyboard. I don't really do it by the mode. It just looks nicer. Uh, getting into the specs, it has a sideward mouse wheel here, forward, that button's Bluetooth, uh, right here on the side, that red button right here is the precision aim button, it slows down your mouse, page forward and page back, these two buttons are programmable, um, as you can see right here, you can adjust the pinky, you can switch out this side here, and you can switch this out, um, bring these you to here, which come in a nice carrying case, shown here. Right here we have a weight case because yes, this mouse does come with weights uh, that you can take out from the bottom. So now getting into a sort of getting the mouse, I guess, adjusted. Here's the bottom. It's nice steel, not steel, but it's metal and it's, it feels nice. Uh, it seems like they use a bit of a cheap plastic, but it has a really nice feel to it. Um, you can see here it's going to adjust the weights. Um, all you do, you just spin that out, and you spin this out here. If I could spin a bit quicker, that would really save us some time. But, okay, so. Alright, that looks like it's about off. And in here, we have our weights, as you can see. Looks like we have about five weights in there and those can be stored in that storage case I actually sort of like my mouse is heavy so I have all of them in right now so we can put this back in here and yeah um, another thing is this is actually this mouse can go very fast um, it has its own preferences for the speed you don't have to go into the control panel or anything um, the difference between all of these things on the back, the palm rest here, as you can see this one sort of has a little bit of a texture to it. This one's a regular default one, it has like a bit of measurements on there. And the difference between these two right here, as you can see, this one is a bit raised, this one's lowered. They don't really have a different size, this one's raised and one's lowered. It's easy to uh, switch those up. As you can see right here, you just have this button, you can click that out. You can switch this one back in, I guess. And here we have the pinky rest. Pinky rest is adjustable by this. So say if I wanted to change it, I could simply twist this. I guess that's not enough. And yeah, so the mouse wheel does feel really good on this camera, on, not camera, on this mouse. And as you can see, here's a textured pinky rest. This is the regular pinky rest. And as you can see, I have the one where I could actually rest my pinky on it, which is what I prefer. And there's just one little screw. This is a really important screw right here, because this is sort of what keeps that on. Um, it looks like these screws are replaceable, though I think I did see a bit of a parts kit on their website. Uh, for some info for you guys, Cyborg Gaming is owned by Mad Cats Gaming. That's one thing, and it is powered by USB. As you can see, it has a nice wire. And yeah, so that's a nice clearing case that it came in the back. It does say that it's for a PC, but it works on Mac. The other ones, I'm not sure if they work on Mac. Okay, so yeah, thank you guys, uh, Sergeant Summary, and I'm